So here's the question. What do I personally think about corner crossings? From a personal standpoint, I think we should be able to corner cross legally everywhere. You legitimately can take one step from a piece of publicly owned ground and put it into another piece of publicly owned ground. The idea that the air above this corners that you move through doesn't belong to the public and belongs to the private seems a little ludicrous to me. And it seems a little ludicrous, especially for somebody who has come from another country that now loves being an American. And one of those attributes of being an American is this idea of public ground that I can access because it is mine. And honestly, if you take it one step further, that public land belongs to the world. Anybody from Australia, South Africa, Pakistan can come and walk on public ground and access it. It's a beautiful system. So where did this all come from? It came from a bunch of hunters in Wyoming that got their wrists slapped to start with for corner crossing. And then it escalated and it escalated all the way up to the Supreme Court. Meat Eater, the local BHA chapter of Wyoming, raised a bunch of money to handle the legal fees associated with these guys' cases. So in the middle of May of 2023, a federal judge in Wyoming ruled that public land users that corner cross are immune from civil liabilities as long as the corner crosses do not touch the private land. They go from public land to public land, right? There were several things that caused the judge to rule in this favor. There was a case in 1974 of farmers being able to move cattle from uh, one set of public to another set of public and being able to having to move through private. And then the Wyoming legislature also put something in place that said that prohibits hunters from moving through or touching private ground, which these hunters did not physically. So what does that mean right now for Wyoming? The hunting season has concluded. I have not heard of any corner crossing issues. I'm sure people have corner crossed because based on the law, based on the edict, based on the decision, corner crossings are potentially legal. I don't have the number of how much public land is now unlocked because of the corner crossing ruling in Wyoming. I've heard the number of 8 million acres are now available through the idea of being able to corner cross. I don't know if that is in Wyoming specifically or across the West that could be unlocked if corner crossing was legal across all of the Western states. But the landowners in this case that were suing the hunters have not appealed the case and the case is now finished. So in Wyoming, do not take this as verbatim, but it is potentially legal to go from one piece of public to another. So I like it. I like the fact that public ground is now accessible to everyone, to Americans, to the world, to the thing that makes American hunting amazing. So that's my answer to what do I think about corner crossings.